Hey uh, legends, we've got a uh, bit of an unboxing to do today for our um, our latest round of beer review. Yeah, I think you're going to enjoy them. So let's uh, let's get into this. Uh, let's get into this box. Forty half slashed the old uh, tape on it. doing this sort of thing by myself but here we go all right let's have a look at what we got here well isn't that a fucking beauty oh there's some special bits in there as well right let's have a look at what we got first one coming out of the uh, box is motorhead overkill pilsner so we're gonna have a have a go at that one looks pretty good is all wrapped up but I do see at the top there motorhead can we get this off without uh, breaking the bottle is it a one-handed operation it's gonna be a bastard this one-handed shit's a bit of a pain stand by Trooper, the collection. So, same on both sides, obviously. So it's got uh, standard Trooper, triple six, six six six, red and black, hallowed, light brigade, and sun and steel. So, a dozen three thirty mil bottles in a collector's box uh, for the discerning Iron Maiden fan. Uh, brilliant, uh, brilliant bloody thing. Let's have, a, let's have a gander inside, shall we? Now there's gonna be people out there that are like, why are you opening the box? Well, I'm opening the box because I'm gonna drink this beer. So, opening it up. This is what we have inside. So there are collectible caps. So you've got the Fear of the Dark cap, Seventh Son of a Seventh Son cap, uh, Final Frontier cap, and the Dance of Death cap. These two ones, these two bottles here with the Union Jack on them, uh, they support the, the Help for Heroes. That's the, um, the British military's, um, like their uh, charity fund and Sun and Steel. Now that's a sake lager. It's got sake in it apparently. And what do we got down in here? We have the collection. So you can buy a collector's frame. Buy this collector's frame from uh, Robinson's Brewery and collect all these caps which is quite a good idea but you know it'll just depend where you're going to get them from. I've got a couple of them downstairs that I've got off my trooper that I've bought over the years singly um, yeah so how's that for a bloody how's that for a bit of a special sort of brew review we're going to be doing all right so moving on to the trooper glass so it comes in its own little container obviously and out comes the glass. Trooper, premium British beer, charged with flavour, handcrafted by Robinsons. And in here we have a bottle of Trooper. And we've got the Iron Maiden, Iron Maiden first album um, cap, bottle cap. So that'll that'll fit nicely in the in the collection of bottle caps. So, I'll chuck that back in there. Biff these in here. Got biff it in there, don't want to break the bloody thing. That's uh, that's pretty good. Now, managed to get another box because 
another box here. Um, I bought a box of a bottle of uh, spirits for the for the wife. So we ended up getting some extra motorhead. We've got this one here called Motorhead Beer Drinkers and Hellraisers Bastards. It's a 4.7. I think this is a lager. This one. Yeah. 4.7 motorhead lager. Uh, and I think another another overkill, so we'll give that another nudge. A couple of more ACDCs. Yeah, another another road crew. Uh, another bastards. And another road crew. Another overkill. And lastly, another ACDC rocker bust. So there's our there's our collection of um, of heavy metal beers that we're going to review uh, lately. Sorry, shortly. We're going to review those shortly. Um, you will never see a Metallica beer in the tiki bar or on this table, or a, a review of it. Um, I will not uh, be reviewing Metallica beer. And that's all I have to say about that.